The last time I talked about Thorn was, wow, like two years ago, guys. So, me as a guide maker for Destiny, that was a very long time ago. Back in the season of The Drifter. Damn, that's been long. But, we're not only talking about Thorn in this video. We want to talk about a possibility of a Thorn Catalyst. Yeah, you heard me right. A Thorn Catalyst. Now, I know it's been long overdue at this point about having a Thorn Catalyst. We got one for Lumina. And we're going to maybe get one from Alfizan soon. But Thorn, what about Thorn? Why are you, why are you saying Thorn, Redrix? What, what are you doing? Freaking me out. Well, we are getting a Bungie 30th anniversary less than a month. Big hyped, Galhorn, all that big stuff. No one's going to be so happy. And basically, with that, is that we are getting a Thorn-inspired armor set. And the way they just said it was Thorn-inspired gave me a good thing. Oh, that's, that's intriguing. They have Thorn all over the Twab pictures... And people on the moon, wow, this this looks amazing. It looks so cool. And I'm like, okay, is there a possibility for a something to do with Thorn? And I was like, maybe there is. Who really knows? We don't know until we see what's going on. We don't know if there if the Bundy 30th anniversary revealed every single weapon. Of course it didn't, probably. Of course there might be more weapons. We know that Thousand Year Stare is coming and Iosuna and Galhorn, but is there gonna be more weapons? Is there going to be something chasing for some, maybe a drop? You know, you never know because usually seasons drop like one or two exotic catalysts from a previous year for an exotic weapon that didn't get it. Bungie usually goes into that. And Thorn, well, that's a great reason to put an exotic catalyst because it's one of those exotic handkins everyone loves from Destiny 1. And if it's a Destiny 1 kind of inspired anniversary pack, Thorn could definitely be a central thing. Like, let's give Thorn some love right now. And if I'm not right there, we got Witch Queen right there. And Witch Queen, oh my god, that's the perfect time to add a Thorn-inspired Exotic Catalyst into there. Now, I don't know what it would be, but I am getting a lot of vibes of what Lumina would be. With what it would be after a final blow, you would get two Remini's, I think it's called, after a kill. And I thought that would might be cool. Or increasing the handling, maybe. I, I'm, not, I'm not sure really what the Catalyst would do. Because I'm not a catalyst guy. But, you know, it would be intriguing to see how it would uh, it would work. I would love to hear you guys' thoughts on what a Thorn-inspired catalyst would be. But again, we won't know for sure. We won't know then. We won't know now. But it's definitely something I want to bring up as a possibility. Because I don't feel like other YouTubers are saying anything about it. And it's definitely kind of something a little bit out of the blue. But it's definitely long overdue at this point. And I feel like Witch Queen is the perfect time to put a Thorn-inspired exotic catalyst because we definitely need one and i feel like right now or even the in the anniversary would be an even good time to do it because it's kind of like the mid-year pack and with that galahorn as well oh my god so definitely something intriguing and yeah just let me know you guys thoughts about that i'll see you guys in the next one bye guys